Hi everyone. Today we're going to look at a very important aspect of if you let your children play in the car, will it be dangerous for them and for the car when they're playing games? We're going to look at it right now. Mal's back talking Tesla. To see the enhancements made to my Tesla and how to update yours, please subscribe to the channel and you can message me with suggestions or for help. Hi everyone. If it's your first time, don't forget we do loads of stuff about Teslas. You're in the right place if you want to learn all about it, then you're here. Great. Now, um, stay to the end because I've got one important thing that you probably don't know and we'll tell you at the end. I was at a service centre the other day and a chap came to me and he said to me, what can we do about the fact that when you're playing games, the kids can drive the car? And I thought about this and I thought, you know what? There is a way of sorting that out and let's have a look at it. So the problem you're faced is this, right? So you'll go into the stuff that you want to do. Um, we'll pick a game like so. Hang on, let me just start this. Play the game. So it's starting Starview Valley. And it'll come along shortly. And this can be a real problem. Because even though it says that you can just exit to drive, you just press the exit button. The children don't know any different. It's a button to them. They press it. They're using the steering wheel to do stuff. They put it in gear and bosh, they're off and a serious accident is going to ensue. So what can you do about it? Very simple. You activate pin to drive. Now I'm hearing you saying, oh, pin to drive. Well, yeah, it's a very simple procedure, right? Let me go into it and show you. Okay, so you hit the car symbol, like so. Then you go into safety and security and scroll right down to there, bottom, and it says pin to drive. Now you can pick, if it's your first time you've done one, you can put in anything you like. I've picked one, two, three, four simple one for you for this demonstration that's not my normal pin so don't think if you see my car anywhere oh, i'll get into mal's car he uses one two three four no i don't but for this experiment i am now that is very painless and once you do that as they go into the game they can't activate it because it'll ask you for the pin and that means that you're safe. They can carry on playing. If they get stuck, they can shout, Daddy, Daddy, I can't drive the car. And then you can say, <laughs> no, you can't. I'm not letting you drive the car. That takes care of that very easily. And as I promised you. Now, did you know this? Tesla, in their wisdom, have taken away the referral program. Now, for those that didn't know, any driver who had a Tesla car or had a friend who has a Tesla car could, with a referral code, get three supercharging miles of a thousand, a thousand free supercharging miles. They who would uh, give you the referral code would get the thousand miles and you who would buy the car would get the thousand miles. It is now gone. Now, for me, I had, very luckily, in the early days, two years ago, they gave 5,000 free supercharging miles. Not 1,000, five. So I got a few referrals, got me over 20,000 miles of free supercharging. So I have still got till the end of November to use up all of mine. Now, some who've got millions of miles, and they've obviously got, because obviously, you know, big YouTubers ended up with great big referral codes. I know my friend Jack Massey Welsh, he got, 227,000 free supercharging miles because he's had shed loads of referrals. It's all gone. No more. So we're all back to no one has that anymore. So the only thing they can ask you on the videos now to do is please, please, if you've enjoyed this and found this very helpful, please subscribe to it. Hit the notification bell because every time I make a new video, you will be one of the first to get it out. And then you can tell your friends and say, oh, look, Mouse bought this one out now. All about this. Well, I hope this has been very helpful to you. And tell me in the comments if you've had any incidents where you, your kids have actually driven the car into the wall. And you thought, why is this happening? Well, now you know what to do. Pin to drive is your answer. Until the next one, I look forward to seeing you. I'll be seeing you. Thanks for watching and do tell us in the comments section that you subscribed and we can then contact you if you're the winner when the prize is drawn. Quack, quack. Oops.